I'm blinded by your light when you're close to me. I heard good things. It's looking pretty awesome, actually. There's a functional area just over here, which you're kind of walking into now, which literally looks like some kind of flipping NFL training camp. Have I walked the wrong way? Yeah, I think I have. <coughs> it's a crazy amount of turf, nice little track. So as you see here, loads of rowers, loads of erg kit. We've got all the assault bikes just over here. As you can see over Sam's shoulder. And this, in my opinion, is the pièce de résistance. So this is effectively, this long track here, I thought it was, an, it was like a Mondo athletics track. I think it's basically one kind of extended lifting platform that you can use anywhere. Got the turf that Sammy Boy's standing on over there, which is an absolutely ginocopod kind of fitness area, functional area. Prowler and yoke over there in the corner. There's loads of deebles. And then we have all the rig and the rope climbs. I think there really is something here for everyone. Have you seen they've got Alipay bars like fucking 20 Alipay bars? Just racks. Like racks of the most expensive bar. But probably with, in in I what I can see right now equipment probably talking 150,000. Yeah, it's got to be loads, loads, loads. When you think of all the Techno Gym treadmills yeah. and stuff over there, it's crazy. So loads of stuff for weightlifters, loads of stuff for CrossFitters, kind of non-CrossFit denomination functional fitness athletes. But for me, this turf itself, whether it's lower body, upper body, or metcon, I'm a massive fan of doing some nice kind of ballistic dynamic sprint drills as part of my warm up even if you know for my wiring from my kind of neurotype testing it showed that even if i'm doing like a bench press workout doing something that is cns dominant as part of your warm up for me personally i absolutely love it and it just really 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 helps me kind of feel nice and warm feel nice and primed even if it's not necessarily lower body just enough uh, that it primes you but not so much that it fatigues you. Sam's got distracted by the Theraguns over there. But again, so for that kind of stuff, sometimes even in any functional fitness area, you struggle with kind of the, the level of depth of space and the volume of kind of like square footage and square meterage of a functional area where you can do things like light plyos and sprint drills and kind of movement mechanics. But this, Gym Box Farringdon, just has ample room to do the stuff. Absolutely wicked, let's get cracking. Here we have Sam Logan. Hello. Former Royal Marine Commando. Get my bum in. Approximately 15 kilos, currently overweight. <laughs> but his pretty facial features make up for it. Hey, Finn, man. Yeah, good. 60 kilo in my arms, 20 for the rest of my body. Oh, nice. That's, that's a really interesting mix. <laughs> Just make shape. it hard to swim. <laughs> right, mate, so on the session, we've got the first workout sorted. Yep which is going to be some assault bike calories and some cleans because we want to do some sandbag stuff but I haven't seen any. I might have a little wonder see if they do yeah. have some sandbags with people but if not we'll replace it with the cleans. What exactly is the workout please? Uh, it's 50 down to 10 assault bike calories and in between each round is uh, 10 cleans to 60 kilo each. So should be a little blast, push, push each other, keep a spiked heart rate, how long can you sustain the uh, spiked heart rate and work, and work hard. Basically. Boom, done. So we'll start that in a minute, just finishing touches to the warm up, and then we shall be cracking on at some point if we have any time to actually think and breathe in the middle of it. We'll be working out what set number two is going to be.
Push there, pull back, 10 rounds. Max effort. Say again? Max effort. Well, max effort for 10 rounds. As in, as in, no, as in like you go, I go. Yeah. Yeah. Break my phone. That was gross man, like, it's not even willpower by the end of it, it's the pure lactic burn just changes your position, forces your bum up on a sled push, it's cheeky man, but it's a good workout, I'm a big, big, big fan, as Sammy is of uh, short sharp work, pain. <laughs> yeah pain, short sharp work for my short sharp rest, if you are in a pair or in a team, in a functional fitness event, you are not going to be keeping the same heart rate going steady state for 20 plus minutes. It's not the way anything is realistically, logistically going to be programmed. So this kind of work of developing your ability to get as recovered as possible, as close to full recovery in 60 seconds, then push it down to 30, then push it down to 20. That's what we're chipping away at today. And it's good, it works. It's not fun in the process. So that's our stuff done guys, we've done assault bikes, done cleans. We are now, well, assault bikes, cleans, lots and lots and lots of prowler pushes and pulls. And now, we're gonna do some more strongman style stuff with some yokes and some kettlebells. And I feel as though a little bit of upper body work is needed. You on the bike and all that crap as well. Workout number three of the day, we have basically a little strongman medley. So we are gonna do you go, I go, D ball, all the way to, uh, to Birmingham and back. And then the same with the prowler, and then the same with the yoke. First time we've used the yoke since Farmstrong. Have you ever used one? Uh, no. I'm just this small natural. Yeah, this, is, this isn't even spinal compression. This is just genetic. But, but, parachute, but, but, but we love them anyway. Open. But we love them anyway. Uh, so, you go, I go on each one of these three, three to five rounds. See where we are. Let's go. We are still here in Gym Box Farron doing myself. That's slogan. Living the dream over there, about to get the barbell. We're about to do some strict press, some push press, and we're actually making quite a good time. We've only been in here nine hours now. Yeah. I think I think it's Sunday. All we're on to event four. Just racks of Alike bars. They're like six hundred quid each. Yeah, they're not uh, they're not mincing on the budget right here, are they? I think there literally must be about a million pounds worth of kit here. That's probably underselling it actually. Uh, so we've done a lot of leg stuff, we've done a lot of definitely l lower body lactic based cardio, which is why now it makes sense to do some overhead stuff uh, to mix it up, get a bit of an upper body burn, 
and uh, and see how we get on. I don't even know what the workout is yet. Sam hasn't told me, but I'm pretty confident it's going to be disgusting. Look at this. Just freaking. These are like five, six inches per inch. Yeah, it's ridiculous, isn't it? Yeah, put this in my bag. <laughs> yeah, of course, he wants to steal it. He's from the north. <laughs> we have former Royal Marines Commando and Absolute Life Legend Sam Logan versus some generic <laughs> guy one. versus Harry Potter in his invisibility cloak. <laughs> the odds are overwhelmingly in Harry's favour. What do you mean? Huh? It's not seeing, can you? Mate, what happens when you go for a workout with Sam? Best intentions ever. Distracted by shiny objects and boxing rings. Why is it called a ring when it's square? I don't know, comment below. What a session and gym experience. I know that. I know that it's been a productive day because the stairs feel very, very cheeky. Right now, just getting out of it. Back up, awesome gym. Quick environment, so much phenomenal amount of good kit, and considering we're basically in central London, phenomenal amount of space as well. The only thing that it was missing, which is what we're walking into now, is a nice little bit of sunshine. It is dark, but basically, it's an incredibly well kitted out dungeon. So, with that being said, it's nice to now come back out. I had to be stuck in one dungeon in the world. If yeah, I'm about to say, it's not a bad dungeon as far as dungeons go. Uh, Session's done, didn't really do a cool down, which is a bit silly. But hey, stretching through in the showers, right? Stretching the showers. What we were appropriate, educated. Now, the favourite part of a gym day, the refuel. <laughs> 